Hi kids! Isang matatag na araw. I'm Sir Noy and welcome to Mat Bilang. In this video, you will learn how to classify triangles according to sides and angles. But first, let's have a review. What is a triangle? Very good! A triangle is a polygon with three sides, three vertices, and three angles. Now, I have here this house. Let us look at the top part of the house. Yes, the roof. How many sides does it have? What is its shape? Yes, it has three sides and is in the shape of a triangle. Do you know how triangles are classified? Today, we will learn about how triangles are classified. We will also learn about the different kinds of triangles. Triangles are classified according to the lengths of their sides and also according to the measures of their angles. Let's learn first the kinds of triangles according to their sides. Equilateral triangle A triangle which has three equal sides which means the three sides have the same length. These symbols or lines are used to mark parts of figures when parts of the same or of different figures are marked using the same symbols. That means those parts have equal measures or are congruent. These triangles are equilateral triangles. They have three equal sides. Isosceles triangles an isosceles triangle is a triangle with two equal sides. These triangles are isosceles triangles. They have two equal sides. The third one is the scalene triangle, a triangle which has no equal sides. These triangles are scalene triangles. They have different measurements of sides. Again, these are the kinds of triangles according to their sides. Equilateral triangle, a triangle which has three equal sides. Isosceles triangle, a triangle which has two equal sides. And scalene triangle, a triangle which has no equal sides. Next, let's learn the kinds of triangles according to their angles. The first one is the right triangle, a triangle which has a right or 90 degree angle. These triangles are all right triangles. They all have a right angle. The second one is an acute triangle. An acute triangle is a triangle with three acute angles or angles each measuring less than 90 degrees. 60 degrees, 70 degrees, and 50 degrees are lesser than 90 degrees. That means this triangle is an acute triangle. These triangles are all acute triangles. All their angles are acute or measure less than 90 degrees. The third one, obtuse triangle. It is a triangle with an obtuse angle or an angle which measures greater than 90 degrees. We have here 50 degrees, 30 degrees, and 100 degrees. Since 100 degrees is greater than 90 degrees, that means this triangle is an obtuse triangle. These triangles are all obtuse triangles. They all have one obtuse angle or an angle which measures greater than 90 degrees. And the last one we have a triangular triangle. A triangle which has three equal angles each measuring 60 degrees. An triangular triangle is actually a special kind of an acute triangle. These triangles are all triangular triangles. All their angles are equal measure 60 degrees. It is important to know that all equilateral triangles are equiangular triangles. And remember, the total measure of the three angles of a triangle is equal to 180 degrees. Here, 
we have four kinds of triangles according to their angles. Right triangle, acute triangle, obtuse triangle, and equiangular triangle. Activity time! Activity number one. Identify each triangle based on their sides as equilateral, isosceles, or scalene. Time's up! Let's check your work! Number 1 has two equal sides only. That means it's an isosceles triangle. Number 2, we have three equal sides. That means it's an equilateral triangle. Number 3, it has no equal sides. That means it's an scalene triangle. Number 4, it has three equal sides. That means it's equilateral triangle. And number five, it has two equal sides. It's an isosceles triangle. Activity number two. Identify each triangle based on their angles as right, acute, obtuse, and equiangular. Time's up! Let's check your work! Number 1, the angles are lesser than 90 degrees. That means this triangle is an acute triangle. Number 2, this triangle has 90 degrees angle. That means it's a right triangle. Number 3, a triangle, one of its angle is 110 degrees. That means it's an obtuse triangle. Number 4. It has three equal angles of 60 degrees. That means it's an equiangular triangle. Number 5. 130 degrees is greater than 90 degrees. That means this triangle is an obtuse triangle. Activity number 3. Match the figure with the correct description.
Time is up. Let's check your work. Number 1. Scale in triangle. Letter C. Number 2. Isosceles triangle. Letter E. Equilateral triangle. Letter B. Acute triangle. Letter A. Equiangular triangle. Letter D. Activity number 4. What kind of triangle described by the given measurements of its angles? It's an obtuse triangle because of angle 125 degrees. It's an equiangular triangle because the three angles are the same. It's a right triangle because of 90 degrees. It's an obtuse triangle because of 110 degrees. It's an acute triangle because the three angles are lesser than 90 degrees. Activity number 5. Who am I? Identify the kind of triangle. I am a triangle with no sides equal. A scale in triangle. I am a triangle with three equal sides. An equilateral triangle. I am a triangle with an obtuse angle. An obtuse triangle. I am a triangle with two equal sides. An isosceles triangle. I am a triangle with a 90 degree angle. A right triangle. Let's learn again. How to classify triangles? Triangles can be classified according to their sides and angles. Always remember, the kinds of triangles according to their sides and according to their angles. It's free! You can get these materials for free. Visit the Matbilang page on Facebook or click the link below inside the description box. These materials can be used as handouts, guides, or posters. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel and like my Facebook page. Happy learning!